Welcome to another video from Guitar School Live. In this video, I'll show you how to set up the Mvave Chocolate MIDI Foot Controller to control the Helix Native plugin in Reaper. Let's get started. To begin, you'll need to download the Cube Suite Editor to your desktop from the Cubave website. Go to the link in the description and follow the download instructions. Installation is simple, so there is no need to cover it in this video. When you launch the Cube Suite program on your desktop, you'll be presented with this screen. To set up the chocolate to control the Helix native plugin, go to the Mode Selection tab and select Program Change A. To set up the Expression pedal, select Expression pedal and click Interface. Click Add. Double click the entry and enter 11 for data. The loosened value is the value of the pedal when it is fully open. Enter 127. The step on value is the value of the pedal when it is fully closed. Enter 0. Click OK. Close the interface and exit the editor. You're now done programming the controller. Let's set up Reaper to control the Helix native plugin. Before we begin, we must first set Reaper to respond to the Chocolate MIDI controller. Go to Options, Preferences, and select MIDI Devices. Choose USB MIDI and enable it. Now we're ready to set up Reaper. Setting up the Mvave Chocolate Controller to control Helix native plugin in Reaper can be done in five easy steps. Step one, add two tracks to Reaper and insert the Helix native plugin into the effects bin of track one. And re-emit a control into the FX bin of track two. Step 2. Select USB MIDI from the drop-down menu. Then drag the routing from track 2 to the routing icon on track 1 and arm track 2. Step 3. Go to the plugin and choose your desired presets and click Save Preset. For the tutorial, we'll save 4 presets named 1 through 4, but you can name them whatever you wish. Note, the presets you select will automatically be assigned a PC number starting at number 1. Step 4. Click the plus button and select link to MIDI program change and select your MIDI channel. For this tutorial, we're selecting channel 1. Step 5. Go to the rear MIDI control setup pane and enable program change. Select load file and click OK for GM Rear Bank and select General MIDI from drop down. Now, you can go to the chocolate controller and your presets will change. To set up the expression pedal, select an effect from the plugin. Right click on a parameter and select controller assign, MIDI learn, and step on the expression pedal. Now you'll be able to control the parameter with your expression pedal. Before we end, if you would like to see more videos like this, hit like, then click the subscribe button and ring the bell so you will be notified when new content is released. From all of us at Guitar School Live, we would like to thank you for watching.